What's up guys? Good morning, good afternoon, good night, whatever it is for you. I hope you're all having a great day today and welcome back to another vlog. <laughs> Last night was an adventure that probably I should have not have taken at all. Tried out hit film for the first time, editing the vlog and everything, and let's just say it's not the best experience in the world. It took me an hour to edit 30 to 45 seconds worth of footage. It was so laggy, so slow, like I couldn't get the audio peaks to show up physically like an image of the audio peaks so I knew where the cuts had to be made and where the mess ups were and everything so I could actually see it like it would take two minutes for that to even pop up and then hit film crashed twice it's notorious for crashing but I don't blame hit film it looks awesome as I said it's like Adobe Premiere Pro and After Effects combined into one there are some downsides like my subscriber little thing that I do at the beginning where I tell you to subscribe and the arrow comes up and it clicks and you hear a noise well that's a gif and apparently hit film treats it as a still image and doesn't play the animated thing but Adobe Premiere Pro and Sony Movie Studio treat it as an actual video clip, a, a transparent video clip, which is why I like both of them. So I went with Old Reliable last night. I think it's just really my computer is not meant for hit film. Long story short, sticking with Sony Movie Studio for now until I finally get a brand new laptop and am able to finally use Adobe Premiere Pro the right way without it screwing up on me all the time like it does currently at the moment. Now that that little rant slash review is all completely over with, we can actually get into this vlog and have an awesome day trying to make a better vlog than I did yesterday like was just not happy with how short it was and the lack of content within the vlog and the lack of a, sort of a storyline like I don't really pay attention to storylines at all but I like to be able to have something within the video that's concrete be like this is what the story of the entire vlog is this is what the day is all about so I'm gonna try to change things up today I am gonna be heading out to work in a little bit so I'm gonna try to film some cool stuff while I'm out and about I always try my hardest when I go off to work because you know it's not very much that I get out of the house during the week so I take every opportunity I can get to film an awesome vlog even if it is while I'm at work Almost completely done with one store for today. I'm not sure if we're going to a second one. It's almost 8 o'clock in the evening right now. I haven't made that decision yet. But I kind of want to get home because I want to eat dinner. And I also want to get working on planning out a photo shoot for this week. As I talked about in yesterday's vlog, I wanted to do something with those Christmas lights that I have. And the Santa hat and Santa suit and everything. And I want to plan that out either to do that tomorrow or Friday or sometime next week. I want to figure all of that out because I really want to get some new photos out. Kind of running out of photos because I want to post some to Instagram. And I'm like, there, there's nothing for me to post my main page at least. I got plenty for the 126 page. You can hear me pull up in the driveway. I just wanna get, get it, get it, get, get it my way. I some people thinking that they could come at me sideways. Do not disturb them cause I really be needing my space. Had a Jeep and turned it to a Benz like it was magic. Vibe is cutting through, I'm starting to feel so fantastic. See the gold on my wrist and all you got is plastic. You could tell YouTube back at it again with the demonetization. I don't know why every day, literally the video will go live and it gets demonetized, but give it a couple of days and that will change from the yellow money sign to that green money sign. It just makes no sense. Now, this is just my opinion, but I really think that YouTube has it set up with their algorithm that certain channels, mine especially, the minute our videos go live, we automatically get dinged. It's just like, your video's live, hey, you're demonetized. We don't know if it's bad or not, but let a couple of days go by or submit for a peer review by one of our people at YouTube and it'll get checked out or it'll get taken care of. It's just like, 
it would make no sense if that was actually the case and I'd probably be really mad because my videos aren't that bad like I'm pretty much family friendly at this point I try not to curse on my videos as I always say and I try not to put anything controversial in my videos at all it is now time to finally sit down for dinner we got ourselves a little Italian Wednesday going here ziti and meatballs this just looks absolutely amazing time to dig in so I feel like one of the most unproductive people in the world right now immediately after I got done with dinner I just sat and watched YouTube the entire time you look at my watch history right now and it is just completely full of reaction videos to Tanner Fox's new music video like the video is so freaking amazing and I wanted to see people's reactions to it and I wanted to get ideas for videos in the future because I still don't know where I want to go with the music side of my main channel now because you know it's filmmaking photography and music I know what I want to do filmmaking and photography I just don't know what I want to do with music music obviously tutorials and covers but I'm thinking about you know like reaction videos that would encompass my love for music and also you know talk about the filmmaking the videography of the music video itself like I think that could be awesome but I have not made a decision yet on that However, I do think it'd be really awesome if I could get a reaction video together this week, put it up sometime between Friday to Monday. As you guys know, I'm not sticking to the main channel schedule. I used to have videos every Friday because I think it'd be awesome that I could just put out a video any day of the week for you guys and you could come and check it out. And the whole decision on whether I do it or not will be based on if I think I need more time on the short film that I'm currently working on, which I probably will. And it'd be nice to have a video to fill in the gap while I continue to work on that film and get it nice and perfect for you guys. I came outside to take the trash cans out to the curb because tomorrow is garbage day, but holy crap, that moon looks absolutely amazing. This camera does not do justice. What I would give to have a DSLR right now to take video and photo of it. I say that phone goes on D&D. Let's put on some p &D. Slip out of that dress for me. Kiss all on my neck for me. Yeah, you know what's best for me. Yeah. I ain't got a light up. You know I'm down to try it all on my overnight shit Run it, run it Back inside from the cold, feels nice to be in a warm house. Tried my best out there to get some shots of the moon. As I said, this camera just does not do justice to that moon, the way it looks and everything. I cannot wait for the future. Like the future looks so great right now when I finally get the DSLR cameras and just all the great photos I'm gonna be able to take, all the great videos I'm gonna be able to take. Like the content is gonna go like next level as soon as I start upgrading cameras, everything. Not that this camera hasn't been absolutely amazing like this camera's been a lifesaver because I mean if you guys remember this damn thing broke the lens just started making all weird noises it's just like what is going on and I had two iPhone vlogs and got this baby it's been a lifesaver it's been so great and like I don't plan on getting rid of it or retiring it anytime soon I plan on keeping it as an extra camera but I plan on getting the DSLR for you know like main channel videos and more professional um, cinematics and sometimes maybe I want to vlog with the DSLR and you know also the photography game will just be 10 times better with a DSLR. It's just so great to see things starting to unfold little by a little. That is going to wrap it up for today's video. I want to thank you guys so much for watching because I really do appreciate it. I want to welcome any brand new viewers that are here right now. I love it that you found my videos and I hope that you come back for more. If you enjoyed this and you so desire to slap a like on it, don't forget to turn those post notifications on down below so that way you never miss when I upload a brand new video to this channel. Also, while you're down there, if you have not already, click that big red subscribe button so that way you get subscribed to all of the awesomeness that MJC Vlogs is. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another brand new a daily vlog. Remember to stay awesome, keep smiling, you're beautiful, I love you guys so much. Peace out, YouTube.